The National Federation works toward getting recognized by the Ministry of Sport in their country and then also their relevant National Olympic Committees. Um, and once they achieve that, they, I mean, that opens up a, a world of opportunities uh, for them. We've had some countries do it already and they're already seeing tons of benefits for, for the sport in their country. I can give specific examples. You know, Aruba um, and Norway both achieved their recognition and it's opened up for Aruba in particularly, uh, or in particular, funding. Um, they're able to, they go into schools and they have some events for kids and teens in schools and teaching the sport in school. Uh, they've gotten funding for their team, their national team, who now does structured training sessions on the weekend, training together, and are able to, they have funding to pay for the team to go and compete. Um, and then on the federation level, the federation leaders are meeting with the National Olympic Committee um, and they're sending them to different trainings, different things, you know, they go to meetings and they learn about things from anti-doping to how to better run a federation. And so they're really kind of taken under, under the wing, right, of the sports systems in their country and learning how to help grow the sport. Um, same thing in Norway. Uh, they, you know, they just got recognized in May, end of May um, this year. So they're eligible for funding in 2020, but already they've had uh, Norwegian anti-doping came to nationals this year and they did over 30 uh, drug tests all of which came back negative, so there are no anti-doping violations. Um, and they're, you know, the president of the Norwegian Federation couldn't be here this weekend because he's at a special um, session, seminar, uh, where they're helping to train him to be a more effective leader for his federation that, you know, the National Olympic Committee of Norway is hosting this and putting him through this. So it's just things to support their growth, um, growth of the federations and also growth of the athletes through things like funding that allows them to have more opportunities. Um, so it's a really huge step uh, for our national federations. So we try to help them along in that process. The recognition process is not easy. It's very long, um, but you know, we try to be support as supportive as we can and give any sort of information and guidance uh, that we have and that we can give to those federations so they can achieve that.